Hi, I'm Daneen Green. I'm a personal chef and caterer, and today I'm going to show you how to make homemade baby food. This will save your family a lot of money. You can use pretty much any vegetable you'd like, or you can do oats, any combination of nuts or seeds if your baby's not allergic. You can also use milk or any kind of stocks or soup broths. Today I'm using sweet potatoes. I like to steam the vegetables. The vegetables then retain more of their vitamin content, and the steaming actually makes them a little more moist, so they're easier to blend. So we're just going to put this on the stove and steam until tender. Now that my sweet potatoes are steamed, I'm going to put them into the bottom of the submersion blender. You can use a Roboku or you can use um, just your regular blender. Anything will work. And then we're going to blend until it's pureed. Now we have a beautiful sweet potato puree. You can store this in your refrigerator for two to three days in an airtight container. You can store this in your refrigerator for two to three days, and it's a great way to give your baby healthy foods with all the preservatives of store-bought baby foods. This is Danine Green, and I've shown you how to make your own homemade baby food. Mm -hmm.